Hey everyone, Jody here with the latest word on all things gaming. Leading off our week is an update on the PlayStation Network. Over the weekend, Sony announced that they will be rolling out a Welcome Back program. PlayStation Plus subscribers, as well as existing PSN users, will be granted 30 days of free PlayStation Plus service. Curiosity subscribers will also receive 30 days of free service, and each territory will be offering selected PlayStation Entertainment content for free download. In a press conference held in Tokyo over the weekend, Executive Deputy President Kazuhirai confirmed that the FBI was aiding its investigation and that we'd start to see a return of the PlayStation Network and its services shortly. In related news, Sony Online Entertainment discovered what they are calling an issue that has led the publisher to take the Station.com web portal offline. This affected players looking to log into games like DC Universe Online, EverQuest 2, Free Realms, Star Wars Galaxies, Pirates of the Burning Sea, and Vanguard Saga of Heroes. In a message on the station website, Sony Online Entertainment stated that they've had to take the SOE service down temporarily, but intends to update the situation later today. Coming up this week in reviews, Thor got a thunder on the Nintendo DS. Carolyn Pettit weighs in on the third-person action adventure game based on the upcoming Marvel movie. We also got a review of Your Doodles Are Bugged hitting the site today. And be sure to look out for Bangayo HD, capsize and more coming later this week. For those of you holding on to the hope of an NFL season this year, you can certainly bank on EA Tiburon delivering Madden NFL 12, regardless of what happens in the real world. New to the franchise is an all-new camera system with filming techniques borrowed directly from the NFL broadcast team as well as a new tackling system that is based on actual player collisions. Madden NFL 12 is due out on August 30th. Switching gears from football to music, Sophia Tong has another soundbite hitting the site today. Recently, she spoke with Gary Scheinman, composer on Bioshock and Dante's Inferno, to talk about how he got into composing for games. Next Monday, California State University Northridge is putting together a live concert featuring Gary's music, and we have two tickets saved for one lucky viewer. So check out the feature for more details. Well, that's all the time we have today. This is Jody Robinson reminding you of where gamers go to know. Let's sync up tomorrow.